prices for several Taiwan-made and imported car models have gone up, with some models selling for up to 100,000 NT more than they did last month. Car makers say the price rise comes amid mounting costs due to COVID and Russia's invasion of Ukraine. The car dealer explains the features of the car models to find the best fit for each consumer. Starting August, the price of many Taiwan-made cars and imported models is expected to go up. I was lucky to buy it before the price went up. It's almost as if I had earned some money. People who need a car for their commute will still buy it. It won't make a difference. COVID and Russia's invasion of Ukraine have sent material and chip costs soaring and disrupted shipping routes. Amid all these unfavorable conditions, car makers say that they can't absorb costs any longer. We didn't want our customers to bear the brunt of it, so we did. We absorbed the costs all up until now. We can't absorb the costs any longer. So the price rise reflects some of these costs. Car models set to get more expensive in August include hatchbacks like the Honda Fit Hybrid and the Skoda Fabia, which will go up by 20,000 NT, or about 2.5%. Sedans, such as the Hyundai Kona, will go up by 10,000 to 30,000 NT. That's a hike of 1 to 3 percent. The Subaru Forester's price is also set to go up by 100,000 NT, an increase of 8.6 percent. Meanwhile, the price of the Lexus ES could go up by 1 percent. For the short term, car buyers are going to have to spend quite a bit more to get the car of their dreams.